What's up, babes? It's your girl, Carlisa Victoria, back with another video. If you guys are new here, hi, welcome to my channel. If you've already been subscribed, thanks for coming back. So I went to Starbucks this morning, and apparently my straw, my, hold on, y'all, I'm sorry. Apparently the straw for my drink, girl, I don't know, it's giving like it's got a hole in it. And I don't think I have any more straws. I don't have any more straws in the car, but every time I drink, I feel like there's a hole somewhere. It is, it's right here. Let me see if I can like rip the straw. There. Maybe like flip it upside down. Here. These lids have not been staying on. Mmm. That was a good solution. There's a hole in the stuff. I got cinnamon in here too. It keeps making me sneeze, but y'all know I have to have my cinnamon for razzle dazzle. Anyway, I wanted to get on this video to let you know, like, since you got the right idea, you're just doing things wrong. What do I mean? So most of you, if not all of you who watch my channel, are looking to grow and develop into like greater than what you currently are. A lot of you, a lot of us have great ideas, but we all know that you can have great ideas, but if you don't put together the proper plan, then those ideas will never be executed. Those ideas will never be, you know, they will never make it to the next level. With that being said, you have got to put those plans in motion. It's one thing for me to be smart up here and not know how to apply my smart, my smartness same thing for you a lot of us have a lot of ideas floating in our head a lot of innovations a lot of things that we are just like if i do this i do this this could do this but we're not doing those things either out of fear of taking the leap we're not doing those things out of feeling like we're not financially prepped or feeling like we just have a lot of things going on that we can't control we have different factors that get in the way of what we're believing in so when I say you have the right idea, you're just not doing anything with it. That's not to say that you can't do something with whatever it is that it is, whatever innovation that you have in your head or whatever it is that you know you could do. The thing is, we got to put a plan to it. Y'all have heard the quote before, failing to prepare is preparing to fail. If you don't set goals, you don't set plans, you don't have an idea on how you're gonna boss up, you're not gonna go places. You're going to go places when you boss up, when you set the goals. I rather set my goals and know that I have an outline than to set my to not set my goals and not have any direction. Goals, outlines can be changed at any given time. But if you don't have any goal set on an outline, there's nothing to really change. You're just going off of the wind, which is not gonna take you very far. It's gonna just be blowing you in every direction. So you wanna make sure that what you're doing, it makes sense, that you've set the goals. We already know you're smart, sis. We already know you have it up here in your head. We already know that you are a boss in the making, at the moment, whatever. For me, 2023, one of my biggest goals is putting into practice, into play, executing what I know up here. This, this book of knowledge up here, my brain is crazy. So now I'm going to start creating those products, those services, those things that I know go hand in hand with my innovations. I have several. I want to relaunch some of my brands. I want to start bringing forth new material. Rich Girls Plan, we're going up on that page this year. So if you're not following Rich Girls Plan, follow Rich Girls. So R-I-C-H-G-I-R-L-S Plan. Rich Girls Plan. Follow that page. And when you follow that page, make sure that you are executing and doing the things that you need to do to be successful. Um... Rich Girl's plan is all about your boss up. It's all about your becoming better than what you currently are. 
if you are constantly at a state of oh i need to do better oh i need to be better but you're not doing or being better it's going to be very difficult for you to succeed so you got to keep in mind like anything that i want i could have but i have got to be willing to put forth the plan execute the ideas and do whatever it is that i need to do i'm watching these people i'm very observant um i do whatever i need to do to be successful that's wherever that's wherever it's going to take me that's whatever's going on whatever i have going on that's literally what you're going to have to do you can't just be like oh i want to be successful and just say i want to be successful no what are you doing to be successful how are you bossing up what can you do to be the better version of yourself a lot of times we say oh i'm capable of doing this i'm capable of doing this and you are but what what are you doing to really boss up and become the better version of yourself are you talking about it are you executing the plan are you putting these things into practice what are you doing who are you surrounding yourself with are you surrounding yourself with people who have no aspirations to go places to do things to be better to go who are you really being around because that right there is going to tell you everything that you need to know if you're hanging around people who don't aspire to be better you're hanging around people who have absolutely no aspirations to do anything with their life if you don't think that that's going to take you and bring you back to a place where you're just going to be fumbling and and not succeeding then you're wrong birds of a feather flock together i say this all the time so you don't want to be sitting here hanging around with people who are not doing anything with their life you don't want to be hanging around people who don't have plans to go anywhere you want to surround yourself with like-minded individuals you want to surround yourself with people who are going to be doing better than you people who aspire to be more because if you're sitting here and you're hanging out with people who are literally just you know existing they have no aspirations to be anything greater than what they currently are they have absolutely no goals to just do more in the new year to do more with their life then the question is like what are you really really doing because people who want more for themselves don't surround themselves with people who don't it's a turn off it's a waste of time it's a headache and it's just like I'm stepping into my, my next level of greatness. What do I look like sitting here surrounding myself with you not doing anything for you? It's giving tacky, to say the least. So, because I know that, I'm going to boss up and I'm going to do what I need to do to be successful. Whatever that is, however that looks, whatever that means. So, that's what I'm doing. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video of you got the right idea, but you need to execute. You execute, you you ain't nobody gonna be able to play with you, sis. They can't play with you now, but imagine when you become better. Girl, please. Unstoppable is the word for the year, okay? Unstoppable, you unbreakable. You going to hit every goal that you aspire to hit. I'm going to make a financial literacy video in this next segment that I'm about to do. But let me upload this so y'all can have some content to chew off of this morning. I'll see y'all in the next one.